And this really is the next phase. Uh, you know, we took this small niche of better for you meat sticks, and, and what we did was after investing it in it, that niche became kind of the lead part of this industry. And so now our little niche that we've nurtured up, up through the way is now the leader in all of meat snacks, conventional and better for you. And so it's an exciting journey that now our brands need to go even further. Um, you know, in these journeys where we grow, it's all about partnership. Um, first, have a great partner in Chomps, a customer who we're going to be building this plant in collaboration with. To really the next is finding a state. Um, and we really targeted Missouri. We know it's a business-friendly state, reasonable regulation, and a place where you can really grow. Uh, we had help from the, the governor's office, uh, economic development, uh, to really kind of know that this is the right home for us. And then next was the community. Uh, the community really rallied around this opportunity. Uh, both the chamber, the city, the city management, uh, really kind of rallied around us joining this community. Um, the next kind of part, point of partnership is finding the right building in the community. And we did find this building, and, and, and now we are partnering with great uh, contractors, Carly and Nelson Company, uh, we'll be partnering with to expand this facility and turn this into a meat production facility. Um, and then the suppliers, uh, you know, part of our pr uh, production process is a lot of different equipment, manufacturing equipment. And so working with those great suppliers. Uh, but really it comes down to the overall partnership we really have to have is the community. Uh, that's what's most important here and we really appreciate how this community has rallied around us. Uh, we want to create good jobs in small towns. That's kind of been our uh, mantra this entire time. And we continue to build that out now as we're approaching seven plants from that one plant in northern Missouri. And so that's very exciting for us. So this is going to be our biggest plant. Uh, we look forward to really growing into it. Um, and we look forward to not just being in this community, but being a part of this community, embracing this community as you guys have embraced us so far. Like I said, we're incredibly proud to be here today celebrating Western Smokehouse ongoing growth that began in Green Top in 2014 and now a sixth location in Mexico. And this phase one 300,000 square foot expansion in partnership with Chomps brings with it an investment of $67 million and the creation of more than 280 new jobs. Now, why I am really here today, uh, Matt, I really just come for the samples because I see them out there on the table. <laughs> so I'll decide for myself whether this is really a good deal or not uh, before, before I leave today. Uh, this is what keeps these small communities together in our state, and they're the backbone of who we are. So when we can help make an investment through our programs at the state level, but the big deal is they chose you. They chose this facility to make this kind of investment. And however you cut it in Missouri, you know, 47, 67 million dollars is a lot of money to invest in these communities. And the one thing that tells you when they make that kind of investment, they're not going anywhere. They're going to be here and they're going to build on that footprint of what they've started. So my guess is the next governor, whoever that is, will be standing up here at some point talking about another expansion. Uh, I hope someday and I We're hope thrilled uh, to welcome Western Smokehouse and Chomps to our community. We are proud that you have recognized the opportunities here and we know you will have a lasting and positive uh, impact in our community.